I'm sure you've noticed by now that legacy has issues that occur in the main menu. There are signs to tell you when your game is buggy, such as when you notice the repeating logos or the old software security posting. It also prevents you from rejoining a server that you had previously disconnected from. This has to do with the PK3 files that you have downloaded by joining multiple servers, like the ET slut that you are. If you were wondering what PK3 files are, they are unique files used by the Quake 3 engine that contains the game's assets such as maps, textures, and sounds. When you have multiple PK3 files downloaded, this creates a referencing problem for Legacy. To fix this, we need to travel to your ET Legacy folder, typically located in your Documents folder. Here you see we have two PK3 files that are creating a reference problem for the program. It's best to delete all PK3 files and then simply re-download them upon joining the server again. If you want a clean sweep of your game, delete all the files, but be careful of deleting your Profiles folder. This contains all of your user binds. This is what a fully wiped legacy folder looks like, running 2.76, the latest software. With these steps in mind, you should have a clean working legacy.